Hello YouTube, uh, this is a quick update. Uh, I was planning to do a video on how to install the radiator, man, but it was so difficult. And the radiator from Amazon really uh, was tough to work with. Uh, it started with the old radiator have a connection for on the bottom for, as you can see on the bottom, for the uh, automatic transmission. So I have to purchase this uh, hiding ultra cool trans uh, cooler and put it between the radiator and uh, put it right there between the radiator and the front of the radiator. So I have to put it right here in the front of the radiator, do an extension with different uh, hoses. Also, when I fill up the, the radiator, it took two complete uh, ready to use uh, one gallon so total two gallons to fill up the tank the radiator also the radiator from Amazon you guys can see a video that I did barely uh, connects over here with the Toyota Supra so I didn't want to put like a uh, tie down and all that so I, I push with a hammer this make it to get a little bit more flat and then support here and then finally connect it here. Uh, also, the Michimoto, Michimoto hoses that I bought at Amazon, a great deal for $65 on sale. They do not fit over here. I spent an hour trying to get it fixed over here. It did not fit. Even the clamp from the factory are getting hard time to get because the diameter is bigger over here same with the bottom so that's the reason on the bottom i put two clamps just to be safe um here there was no the factory of course no problem here but the one on the bottom was uh, a pain in the neck but i overall very happy with the way it looks so i have the transmission cooler right there gotta return this back to amazon really a shame because I really like it, it really make a contrast on the car, but it do not fit. Uh, so strongly recommended. Try to get the different. Uh, actually, the heat Mishimoto Mishimoto radiator is like five hundred dollars on Amazon. This one I pay probably one hundred and sixty nine. Uh, it's three level type of um, radiator, but uh, finally I got it installed. Also. With this radiator here, I couldn't get this housing for the fan to connect at all with the radiator. Doesn't have any point or connection, so I have no choice but to uh, leave it off completely. So this housing over here, I have to leave it completely off. So, well, that's the price you pay when you want to save money and then... Uh, you go with a $169 radiator, aluminum radiator, three level, that's what they call it. So I had to change this and the hose, unfortunately I couldn't use it. Again, make any comments, suggestion, uh, likes, and uh, I'm trying to reach 3,000 subscribers, but so you guys can see here, uh, the next project would be to install uh, the Brainbow calibers. I did a video. I have it in another video of you that I purchased those in a uh, junk jar. And I plan to do a video on how to do installation. But today I'm super tired. It's my last day off. Um, again, subscribe, like, um, any comments, and uh, any suggestions. Uh, but uh, just the video. Well, the reason I did this video is because the price you pay for going cheap. When you buy an Amazon radiator that uh, is really, they say that, yeah, it will fit, but in reality, it's not that easy, especially make a connection in the bottom because the diameter is way bigger, so I have to use a different clamp. Okay? Thank you. Subscribe, like, and uh, give me any, any objection or comments. Thank you.